Hey guys, Jonathan King, Custom Marine. I'm wanting to show you one of the most exciting boats. Just, it's amazing how uh, how many features the 267 Masters by Sportsman has. Uh, I had to get up in it and really go through it myself. I, I read all of it and, and know most of it, but actually getting in the boat and seeing it really kind of blew my mind. Uh, this 267 Masters comes standard with a 300 Yamaha. So he's a good performer with that 300. You can check the performance reports for exact numbers, but you know, flirting with 50 on the top end. Um, this particular hull was designed with trim tabs molded in. So that tab, tab, tab additions weren't an afterthought here. You can see the underwater lights down there. You can see, uh, again, the other tab, the integrated swim platform. It's the C-Star HD jack plate. C-Star makes some great products. The HD is actually for uh, 300 horsepower and above. So that's the heavy duty jack plate. Um, you can see the C-Star canister back there. But this is Optimus by C-Star, which means it's electric steering. So it's, you know, whether you're in a hard turn or, or trying to maneuver in close quarters, that electronic steering is just hardly any effort at all goes into having to make a, having to steer. Um, we'll kind of walk around the boat and see the through hulls there. You'll also see that this boat is uh, gray uh, below the water line to match the color of the underside of the T-top, which also kind of matches the day we have here today. It's a pretty gray day. Um, see the bow backrest there. We'll get into that. There's, there's a proper way to do bow backrest in a bay boat and in a not so good way. I think Sportsman chose the proper way. Uh, though, as often is the case, it's probably the more expensive way to integrate those into the bow. While we're walking around the boat, letting you get a look at the whole thing, you'll also see that we've got sitting on a tandem axle Magic Tilt trailer. Guys, this is an all welded trailer designed specifically for this boat. It's a, uh, what we call a custom trailer. And Magic Tilt built this trailer specifically to fit under the 267 hull. So in and out at ramps, fantastic. Traveling at length, fantastic. It's a good trailer for, for taking what it really is a top end premier premium boat. Uh, whether you wanna to go to Miami or you, you wanna to go to Narragansett Bay and catch stripers, you name it, this boat's good up and down, up and down I-95. We, uh, cus uh, sportsmen went ahead and put their LeBrock style racing chairs in this setup. That's what you have there. Um, so whether you want to hop up in them and uh, sit and ride high, or you want to fold the bolster forward and, and, and lean against them, you got about 12, 13 inches of back support there where you've got them stacked like that. Also too, you could fold the armrest out in and out of the way looking here at the stern massive fold-up seating room for two people on both sides um, two and two or just really one really big cushiony comfy chair uh, on each side and in this model sportsman does not do away with their below deck access through those massive uh, seat bases you do still have very good access to the stern. Let's climb up in here. Case in point, getting below. Look at there. Five gallon bucket storage. Access to all your pumps and switches. Fantastic, look how well all that wiring and how clean all that is down below. Exceedingly well done. I often think, as long as I've been selling sportsman boats, that they don't really belong in the class that they're discerned to be in. They are miles and away better than the competition. And you can see it in the way things are finished out and done. 
a massive release well in the center of the stern, along with two very nice live wells on each corner. So three wells here on the back. The center one, of course, is oxygen. It's got the oxygen uh, to keep your bait nice and frisky, oxygenator. See the cup holders, the rod holders. You still got Sportsman's uh, proprietary uh, deck drain system. The stainless steel drains in the floor. Under the gunnel rod storage, which is a must. Nice, nice gunnels. Nice cushions on the gunnels. That'll make the difference of it at the end of a long day. Whether you go home or decide to go out and have a good time with the with the family, should still have plenty of energy left to go have fun. The so Brock chairs are a key part of that comfort. Again, standard Simrad system in this boat. A single 12 inches standard. Hard top. Built-in speakers, Simrad VHF. <coughs> There's your electronic, your Optimus EPS C-Star electric steering. <coughs> Pardon me, trim tab controls. Yamaha's XCA throttle, digital throttle by wire. Notice too, folks, on this console, instead of a molded-in tray, plastic tray that a lot of companies do, <laughs> see hunt. we actually have a fiberglass console with a step built into it, built into it in the form. No creaking, no weak feeling, no cracking. Again, really high end. Moving forward. Get into this bow. Now, as I mentioned, there, there's there's some good ways to do bow seating, and then there's some better ways. To me, this this is one of the better ways. You see the handhold, grab hold there. You also see the backrest. <coughs> Even with the backrest actuated, you don't lose access to your five rod locker. Push it forward and it reclines all the way back. Same thing on both sides. The big bow cushion, but it's very comfortable for the family. But one of my favorite features, and not many companies do it, you've actually got a bow live well in this boat. Got, got a fish box, of course, but right here is a bow live well. It, too, is oxygenated. Got your own secret supply of bait up here in the bow. Rod locker, too. Got a rod lock, excuse me, uh, anchor locker as well. Walk around gunnels, massive deck. Huge cooler built into this console. Guys, this console is the same one they use on a lot of their uh, offshore boats. Plenty of protection, plenty of room. You've got somebody that needs access to a potty while underway. More than enough room for that. You've got even got some sea deck in the bottom. To take care of bare feet. It is lit in there, and you do have a lot, and you do have a a window to keep light in there. This uh, live well, I'm excuse me, this leaning post, tackle storage, miscellaneous storage, there's, there's your uh, battery switch. More storage in that box. And still more storage here in your leaning post. Pull out drawers, two hand cabinet, big woofer here, 
fantastic sound system. LED lights, LED spreader lights, LED map light. Another light, courtesy lights down below. The boat is loaded. And pretty much all of it standard. So give us a call at Custom Marine for more information about the 267 Masters. 912-681-7777.